This one is a good test for your own self. I love that you have taken the decision to disprove this outside of the group energy. Please do it please. It will create a great dialogue to edit and post. Thank you so much. With me I spent my whole life undergoing challenges. This woman has her experience of her letdowns by people she describes. Yet I would never adhere to her sovereign movement as she herself is embedded in laws. She is not talking as a sovereign person. She is entangled in laws. She is not sovereign according to my definition. She has given her power over to the laws that were created to keep us under the laws. She speaks loops, not absolute. She is actually confusing the sovereign movement. She is old energy. As I always say, listen without judging the speaker. I am not trying to disprove anyone. Sorry about caps there to emphasize only I am looking for truth and nothing but the truth. The lady above defends authority, governmental laws, etc. That is her problem, not mine. What she said during the first five minutes nailed it. Dot for me, dot why some people are afraid if questions. That piece explained much, dot but I haven't stopped there. I am now into specifics about the trust and am reading information describing it as a criminal organization. More important, dot how and why it is such. I am not bothered by names. I want verifiable info. So, Troy, I am at my happiest when I can share info with others without being personally attacked. I remain disattached to all of it because then, what I learn today, I am able to unlearn tomorrow, if I choose. Do you want me to share the info as I discover stuff? Would you care to give me your feedback on it? Positive or negative without shooting me? I am simply gathering info and after I will give it my consideration. Back again. My point is that TW claims all he says is right, and others are just saying that he is wrong. Dot and everyone just making offensive statements about whoever they don't like. I'm looking for facts e.g. How many others comprise the Mana Trust team given that Kim declared specifically that there is a team? What roles do they occupy? If this lady's DNA was her recognition to her right to control the trust, who conducted and produced the results of the DNA test and after, to whom was the document produced? Question mark question mark question mark. One would imagine that however far down the list of authority, heads of governments would at least know who is holding the country's assets. I have many more questions of this kind and feel that uncovering untruths is more important for humanity at this point on the game, so to speak, than criticizing another's personality. I'm not trying to shoot you in any way yet what I say, at times, may come across as someone who does their research and they have thought it through from all angles and then somebody comes along and asks s obvious questions without having done any research and who then brings back onto themselves a backlash from the researcher. From his point of view, he has done all of the thinking and research and plugged all of the holes during his discerning of the situation and then is challenged by somebody W. Who did not understand or did not do the proper research. This, I believe, is what's happening with Tommy as I see many things in common with him. He is deep and does research through his own filters and also perceives through his own experiences, yes, and this is similar to what happens. To me, I came to the conclusion that most people judge things on a superficial level without going into deep thought about things and this causes a level of frustration within the ones who have researched in regard to the others who are very superficial, or so it seems. This superficial level of thinking has caused the masses to agree with that same kind of thinking and because of this, society then calls it right. There are a billion things on this planet at this moment that could be categorized into this level of research and understanding thus bringing ab. Out a separation between the davancies of this planet, which are about 10% of the population who look beyond the box, and those people who are still looking inside the box and find the same explanations that were created by the same level of chaos. So I'm trying to explain the difference between the wise, mature thinking person and the one who just wants to dismiss it or debunk a concept through a mere glance at the top headings that come up in Google which that search engine wants to hold everyone onto and which is of the old and dismiss. S. The new paradigm. They put links at the top of the research result page so as to make sure that this is what you see first. Remember all information to do with knowledge has been manipulated not only by the controllers but by all those loyal followers of the same information. 
A sovereign integral has nothing to do with a sovereign movement of proving yourself in the courts with their law systems and excusing why the systems are all right the way they are. We need to think outside of the box and this kind of thinking is the capital of thought now of the collective con. Sheerness which causes the holographic universe we live in and there's no changing this to the truth without the mirrors of ignorant reflections coming back at us saying this is not true, so prove it. Make me understand a hologram completely and it is not easy as it is a new way of thinking outside of the social box and the task of explaining it to the people still in the box is like telling a fish what it is like to walk on land. It's a new day, it's a new way and the truth is going to have its say. So now this is what we do, we already know that everything almost was a complete lie from them. So rather than play the game of I will prove it within your box, we go and just do things for ourselves in our dream state. Fully knowing that this is the holographic universe. We just do things without any need to prove anything to anyone else as this is our adversary mirror reflection telling us that we have improved it rather than having to prove it and answer those who say, we don't believe you. This is the first rated level. I was wondering why it is that these mirrors never ever reflect this truth. I have done the research I approve them every single level of this research and now I get people who won't even properly put a proper research question into the search engines, tell me I need to prove it to them again. This is the separation in my mind between the masses and myself. So no, I have to ignore the messages with these kind of questions as irrelevant and insignificant and leave them in their ignorance since everything that I have done to prove anything to them has n ever been qualified enough or acknowledged by the masses and no one ever says, I apologize, I accept your explanation, I see where you're going etc etc due to their own internal pride and it just does not sit with me anymore. It is over and done with and for everyone who's still wanting proof, they will have to find it for themselves. I am seeing all of this as this is my truth and I do not wish to insult anyone who may still be inside of that box of thought and who is looking for proof. This is me standing up and saying I will not accept your limitations anymore it doesn't matter to me and I owe see my gun to you if I seem obnoxious and overbearing rather than give my power up to the box with the label prove it. I welcome all your comments especially if you see what I don't see. I was referring to when you say that people try to force the perceptions on you. That is when you shoot at people. Next, about who has researched and who has not. That is an assumption, no, a judgment, no one has the title or right to do that, my opinion is that it is always better to answer and use politeness. Dot 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 exclamation mark exclamation mark exclamation mark exclamation mark exclamation mark exclamation mark. My point is that T.W. claims all he says is right, and others are just saying that he is wrong, dot and everyone just making offensive statements about whoever they don't like. I'm looking for facts. E.g. How many others comprise the Manor Trust team given that Kim declared specifically that there is a team? What roles do they occupy? If this lady's DNA was her recognition to her right to control the trust, who conducted and produced the results of the DNA test and after, to whom was the doc? human produced. One would imagine that however far down the list of authority, heads of governments would at least know who is holding the country's assets. I have many more questions of this kind and feel that uncovering untruths is more important for humanity at this point on the game, so to speak, than criticizing another's personality. I'm not trying to shoot you in any way yet it may come across this way as someone who does their research and they have thought of all the angles and then somebody comes along and brings out the obvious kess. Times without researching brings back a backlash from the researcher was done all of the thinking and research and plugged all of the holes in discerning of the situation and seen it in their way and is challenged by somebody who did not understand or did not do the research as incomplete. This is what's happening with Tommy as I see many things in common with him as he is deep and does research through his own filters yes through his own experiences yes but at the same time it is similar to mine where I found out that most people judge things on a superficial level without going deep. And it causes a level of frustration within the researcher to the others who are very surface it seems and this surface kind of thinking has caused the masses to agree with that thinking and it becomes what society calls right. 
There are a billion things on this planet at this moment that could be categorized into this level of research and understanding and so it brings a separation between the Davinces of this planet which are about 10% which look beyond the box and the people who are looking in the box for the same EXP. The nations that were created by the same chaos on every level. So I'm trying to explain the difference between the wise mature thinking person and the one who just wants to dismiss it or debunk it by finding something that they googled in the first top lines of Google which Google has set out to hold. Hold. I am thinking and to dismiss the new paradigm. And put these links at the top of their research so as to make sure that this is what you see first. Remember all information of knowledge has been manipulated for main control not only by the controllers but by all the lawyer followers of the SAM. E information. A sovereign integral has nothing to do with a sovereign movement of proving yourself in the courts with their law systems and excusing why the systems all write the way the air, but are done in a way where we think outside of the box and this thinking is the capital of thought now oh. F the collective consciousness which actually is the holographic universe we live in and there's no changing this to the truth without the mirrors of ignorant reflections coming back at us saying this is not true prove it. Wake me understand a hologram completely and it is not easy as it is a new way of thinking outside of the social box and to explain it to the people still in the box is like telling a fish what it is to walk on land. It's a new day it's a new way and the truth is going to have its say. So now this is what we do, we already know that everything almost was a complete lie from them. So rather than play the game of I will prove it within your box, we no go and just do for ourselves in our dream state annoying the th. Is is the holographic universe and we just do without any need to prove to anyone else as this is our adversary mirror reflection telling us you have improved it you haven't proven it and we don't believe you. To the person who was thinking outside the box this is the first rated level one was wondering why is it these mirrors will never ever reflect this truth I have done the research I approve them every single level of this research and now I get people who won't even properly put into the search engine. S a proper research question to come up with a deep answer to tell me I need to prove it to them again. This is the separation in my mind between the masses and myself. So no I have to ignore the messages as irrelevant and insignificant and left in ignorance as everything that I have done to prove a nithing to them has never been qualified and acknowledged by these masses and said I apologize I accept your explanation I see where you're going etc etc because of their own internal pride and it just does not sit with us anymore. It is over and done with and for everyone who's still in this situation of prove it would have to know thing to prove himself. I am seeing all of this as this is my truth is not to insult anyone else inside of that box of thought of the prove it, it is me standing up and saying I will not accept you. Your limitations anymore it doesn't matter to me and I owe see my gun to you I will seem of obnoxious and overbearing rather than give my power up to the box of prove it.